Hey guys, since lockdown, I'm sure, like me, you've started to watch a lot of online content and maybe slowly becoming a potato. That just might be me. But recently, I've started to watch a lot of Vox videos and I'm amazed by their motion graphics, one of which from their Atlas series range. So I'm going to break down their map reveal on a piece of paper. For this, you'll need three things. One, drawing of a map. Two, textured plain paper. Three, this black and white ink reveal effect, which you can get from the internet. Open After Effects and load all of this. Now, I created my map in Photoshop as I wanted to colour in each of the four different countries that make up the UK differently. So Wales, Scotland, Northern Ireland and England. This meant when I imported the map, After Effects pre-comped it for me. And this is important as this is how we we'll apply the textured paper effect on the map. In your comp, you'll need a pre-comp of the map and the paper texture to sit underneath it. From here, go to blend modes. If you can't see it, click on this button at the bottom, toggle switch modes and change the mode from normal to overlay. I'm going to duplicate the UK map to make it stronger against the paper. Then pre-comp all of this. On this comp, this is where the ink effect will be. I'm going to place it in. I'm just going to move it along to see the effect I want. Perfect. Then scale up or down to fit your screen. The reason we're using this ink reveal is in the ink will reveal the map. To do this, go to track mat and select Luma invert mat. I'm going to back into the pre-comp. Once you want the effect to end, click on command shift D to split the layer and delete the layer you don't want. Actually, mm, I think the map's too strong. So I'm just going to go back into the pre-comp and take off one of the maps. Perfect. And literally you're done. It's that simple. Now you can go further with this and add the yellow box and the text which you, which you can then reveal by masking and keyframes. Just a public announcement. I'm sorry I wasn't there last week. I've been a bit flaky since the new year, I know. Fingers crossed, I'm back on my game and you'll see me next week at 12pm. While you have the time, please check out my TikToks, I'm only just getting into it. While in lockdown, I had a look at my stats. And do you know that 98% of my viewers aren't subscribed to me? So please consider subscribing to me. Smash the like button to let me know if you like this. And as always, stay inspired.